Hi, today I'm going to show you how to use Gemini in Google Docs. So, in order to do this, first of all, open Google Docs on your PC. Now, after opening the documentation in Google Docs, you'll have to simply click on this small Gemini icon at the top right. So on the Google Docs page, you will see this icon that is star shaped. Just click on this and it will show an option to try Gemini. Now, if you want to use Gemini in Google Docs, it will typically be available through eligible Google Workspace or Google AI plans. So if you have those plans, then that's great. If not, you'll have to click on try at no cost button. Now, another page will open up where you'll easily be able to sign up for Google Workspace. So choose a Gmail, then click on continue option, or you can also create a new Google account to buy this plan for Google Workspace. After you buy the plan, you'll be redirected back to the Google Docs where you'll be able to click here and you will see an area to enter a prompt. So I will show you an example. This is support.google.com's page. Here, you can see you can easily collaborate with Gemini in Google Docs by clicking here and the page will look something like this. As you can see, you'll get an option to enter a prompt here. And for example, the user has written summarize features from the latest proposal and Gemini instantly did that in the Google Docs. And as you can see, the steps are just like I shown you. On your computer, you'll have to open a Google document from Google Docs. At the top right, you'll have to click on the star icon. Then in the side panel, that is this, you'll have to select a suggested prompt or write your own prompt. Also, you can explore Gemini in Docs by doing these. So these are the actions that you can do using Google Gemini. And this is the description. For example, if you would want a preview, you'll have to write preview the full suggestion before you insert it. So you can also navigate here and learn more about exploring Gemini in Docs. So that is the simple way through which you can use Gemini in Google Docs. If you found this guide helpful, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and thanks for watching.